opening the third eye is often associated with spiritual practices, a concept that has intrigued, fascinated, and left a vast majority in deep thought. Now while there may be no explicit scientific evidence to support the existence of a literal third eye, some people, scholars and spiritual enthusiasts believe in practices that aim to enhance intuition, insight and awareness. This belief carries a lot of weight in certain cultures, religions and spiritual communities worldwide. Let's delve deeper into some common techniques believed to stimulate this enigmatic third eye. Primarily, meditation, a practice that involves focusing your mind on a particular object, thought or activity, to train attention and awareness, and achieve a mentally clear and emotionally calm and stable state. It's not just sitting in silence, but it's about quieting the mind to enhance concentration and relaxation. Next is visualization, an extremely effective mental technique involving the conscious act of creating pictures or images in your mind's eye. It's about using your imagination to create what you want in your life. It's said to stimulate your third eye based on the theory that we create what we can imagine. Following this is mindfulness, a psychological process of bringing one's attention to experiences occurring in the present moment without judgment. In a world where multitasking is lauded, mindfulness encourages focusing on one task at a time, promoting peace of mind and clarity. Yoga, an ancient physical and spiritual practice, harmonizes the body with the mind and breath through the means of various breathing techniques, yoga postures, asanas, and meditation. It's believed that specific yoga postures can stimulate the third eye. Energy work, like Reiki and Qigong, is a holistic healing technique where a practitioner channels energy into a patient's body to activate the natural healing processes and restore physical and emotional well-being. Many believe that this energy work helps clear blockages in the third eye. Intuition development, the process of honing your gut feelings, is also considered a route to opening the third eye. This involves learning to trust your and making decisions based on your intuitive feelings rather than overthinking. Remember, opening the third eye is a personal journey and results may vary from person to person. It's essential to approach these practices with an open mind and without any preconceived notions or expectations. It's not a one-size-fits-all experience and can differ based on individual perceptions and experiences. If you have concerns or specific goals, consider consulting with a qualified spiritual or holistic practitioner for guidance. They can provide personalized advice based on your circumstances. Lastly, it's important to remember, the journey towards opening the third eye requires patience and discipline. It's not an overnight process, but a gradual transformation of consciousness. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to subscribe for more content like this.